Hey guys, welcome back to some more Super Auto Pets. We're going to get right into it. New weekly since the last time I posted. And I'm not going to lie, I am enjoying the living hell out of this here weekly. Um, we're going to go ahead and grab a moth, grab a bluebird, and grab a beetle. Honestly, just buy out that shop right away. I'll freeze a couple ducklings for the future. They are really good selling units early on here. Get you some nice either... A level out of them if we can get one more or if we're really feeling randy we can sell them for some health i'm gonna grab that win so we'll be on five health come tier three units so come round three no matter what which is nice buy both holy shit um i am gonna sell both of them then and purchase that one i am also gonna sell this and purchase this one freeze because, I mean, why not? Because now we got a... F I mean, we had a 7-7, seven, seven, which isn't necessarily the best. We probably should have switched up the order, if I'm being fully honest. Let's go ahead and move the microphone a little bit. I, I just... You know, I like to talk into it, you know? That's kind of the goal. Do one of those. A hoopoo bird... Definitely can help, but we're going to buy the starfish for now. Buy the duckling. Sell. Which gives a 1-1. One, one. Roll one. Holy hell. Do this. Sell. Giving another 1-1. One, one. It's going to hit the moth again. Put another moth out there. Honestly, you. There. We'll keep the four squad. The starfish is not longed for this world, but when... A decent amount of the units, like the chipmunk you see there right away at the front of that team, or the uh, duckling or the pig, they, uh, they're they pretty good units to elicit the help of a, of a starfish. Now we're getting into that realm of mediocrity on some... Oh, never mind. Never mind. I'm going to keep you out of there, or we're just going to do like that. Sell you. Buy this. Sell. Get a 1-1 one -one somewhere. Okay, then we are going to purchase, roll, perfect. Honestly, not perfect, but will be fine enough. Are we going to be able to clear that? We are. Oh, easy. Beautiful. Peacock difference. Let's go. Ooh, we get ourselves a level three right off the bat there. All right, so we're going to do that. Do one of these. Pill this. Let's run a second. I, before I hit end turn, I should probably be a good puppy papa and go take my dog out. I'll be right back. Rare rare edit in the Super Auto Pet stuff. And he is back. All right. Finally end my turn. Maybe the longest turn in Super Auto Pets that I've had, unless I've fallen asleep during a round, which I have done. I'm not going to sit here and lie like I haven't. We're gonna get this win. I mean, easy. No one's getting through our meloned moth. I mean, it's pretty, pretty easy. Um, it's odd, but give me a roll and double me up on some worm, like that and like that. Sure. Sure. Two worms. So basically, I'm going to spend four gold to get a 2-2 two, two buff, which isn't terrific. But that's not why we're here. Let's start getting this bad boy going. Do something like this. Combine. We'll run you for one round and sell you next round. It's the long con. It's the long con for sure. I'm going to scoot forward a little bit, maybe. Hello, puppies. Do not sniff my bag of chips. Thank you. Oh, perfect. That's what I wanted. Think about that. Sell you. 1-1. One, one. Do that. Do this. Roll it. Freeze.
Okay, we're gonna buy the Triceratops first. And then we're gonna sell the the starfish because it's past its best before date. And then we are going to buy the blobfish because there are pills in this pack. So sell. Instead of a Triceratops, give me an eel. We'll just keep... We'll add to the Blobfish, and hopefully we can get a level 2 and then pill it in front of this eel. And maybe by then we get three eels in the shop. I just don't see a lot of eels. So I don't know. Maybe. I'll take it. I'll take another win. I mean, we're on six wins, four life left. You can't really complain on that. Do one of these. Do one of those. Roll. Roll again. I'm going to go with a pepper on you, to be honest. A little bit of a burp there, but a it's not from the pepper. I didn't eat any, but... Maybe I should put the worm at the back. Worm at the back is probably smarter. Yeah. So that it's not getting sniped by crocodiles like that. Do that there. And honestly, Worm being on the team in general just isn't smart. We can throw a Dragonfly out there, and I think they'd be golden. Do one of these. One of these. Get some double up action. Oof. All right. Notification on the phone. Let's just check it. Oh, look at that. I got messages on the hold. Beautiful. Oh, they killed our, um, like, basically our best unit. Second best. Well, one of our best units. That's crazy. That's not cool. Let's just do that for a little bit. Do you? Is there anything that I realistically want to flip the stats on? No, so we're rolling. Rolling. I'll take both of those. I'll roll once more. Yeah, just nothing. I mean... <laughs> I, this run had promise. Had promise. Does it now? I mean, no. If I'm being fully honest. Not not in the current endeavor. I mean, snipers are still strong this weekly. So we'll do one of these. Sell you for now. This. This. Oh, I only need to freeze one. We're going to do something like that. Something like that. It's going to pass back two XP. It's going to give it buffs. And then there's still going to be one in front of it. It didn't really help at all. It, it actually yeah, it didn't make any difference. Holy shit. That went from zero to negative 100 real quick. Okay, run back, run it, run it back. Chipmunk has always been good for me this weekly. It seems we'll do one of those. Just keep it with our two threes, three twos. Maybe the stats are what's gonna propel us. Maybe not necessarily the uh, the. Well, I mean, they just had better stats, I guess. I guess fish. Chipmunk again. I'm gonna. I'd rather keep. I'd rather keep a. Uh, a seahorse to be honest with you because at least the seahorse can mess with someone's order the chipmunk i haven't really i thought i had a good ability possibly but i just don't ever put food on it oh puppy you shakens huh it's just it's like a good level i guess so we'll do one of those i want to buy a dromedary dromedaries are pretty sick this week um combine i'll buy a salamander i'll throw an apple on it I could have froze the peacock. I don't think the peacock is all that good this week, to be honest with you. From from my own beliefs, which are not fact, but my own beliefs. Um, let's do one of those, one of those. Do that. That's a start of battle. Okay, so then we will... It's a start of battle that actually might help us. Shockingly. I mean, we're going to lose here pretty easily. Yeah. Not great. 
That's what I wanted to see. This is tough. We're going to roll one. I am going to sell the dromedary. I'm going to buy you. Roll again. Purchase you. I'm looking for one. Honestly, let's just fuck with someone's order real quick. That It's not going to do much. We're fucking with the order more. I want to see one of these get to level two so then I can sell it and feel like I'm not wasting anything. But I'm going to... Okay, there. Good. Sweet. Thank you. Sell. And for the time being, honestly, you just, I mean, I'll screw up some orders. We'll do one of those. Freeze. Roll. I'm going to do something like this. I don't think we're going to be coming out of this very well at all. No, no, we are not. We're going to lose again. Unfortunate. Do one of these. Sell. Sell. Sell the fish. Buy the draft. Buy the hippo. Roll one. There's a hippo. We might have to get rid of our jellyfish. I mean, we've had one level since it's been on the squad. A single level. And now we got two levels on it. Sell you. Purchase you. Sell you. Purchase. Okay, now we're starting. So we're pivoting. Keep the salamander. We're not really focusing on start of battles, which I don't think is. The, well, I mean, okay, they just fucked up our order big time, and that really upsets me, but it's not going to matter because of a level two hippo. Level two hippo is just crazy. Anything. A hippo in general is just crazy. Um, so I'm going to sell you. I'll purchase you. Purchase. Beautiful. Um, sell you, buy this, sell this, buy this. And our salamander is going to be getting buffed no matter what because of our dragonfly. I went full hippo. And honestly, us having a turtle is phenomenal for this. It, maybe it's not the greatest when they just have really good units as well and they're doing they're running a back bacteria team which is crazy so we're gonna do this do one of these roll more on the hippo we got to get this hippo going we gotta get the hippo going okay um the tiger dying is not like really all that fun but it's not the worst thing in the world it just means that our hippo was a little weaker at the end of this so let's just do this for now freeze this for now i will take a level two dragon fl fly yes we'll do something like that and then maybe we end up pilling our turtle if we able to and get a get a snaky boy out there okay that that works i mean that that's just phenomenal that, i mean that's a win if we can get it to where it kills something without dying right away, we are going to be in business. Okay, so sell the turtle. Purchase this. Let's try this. I know we're on lethal. I know this could be bad news. I do want to see how much bad news, though. That works. Okay, it's not bad news at all. Boom. Boom. Roll. Boom. If the snake gets sniped, not the end of the world, because then the tiger will be doing that to the hippo. Now it's not the end of the world yet as well, because, I mean, we still got the two triggers out of it. 
Okay, I mean, this is just... This team is coming together nicely. Bang. The issue is, is now the dragonfly isn't really serving as big of a purpose anymore. And it's not really going to matter because we are going to lose. Barely, but we are going to lose. Run it back. One more. One more. I wouldn't say a traditional start. Not really. I'm not too happy. I did. I have gotten a couple 10 pieces. I did make an axolotl work. But I am I have an idea in my head if it can pop. If I can get the axolotl early enough and keep a beetle on my team, the beetle is going to get permanently buffed because the beetle's new thing is the start of battle, gain the perks, and they're different perks as you level it. And an axolotl is when a friend gains a perk, you permanently gain stats. So if I can keep a beetle going and keep enough health to where I get an axolotl early... For when they show. I have a weird scaling idea. And I, th I think it could work. So we'll do one of these. Something like this. Sell this. Buy that for now. I'm going to sell it immediately. Do this. Sell you. Because a 4 one I don't value nearly as much as this. Roll. Holy shit, some self-sustaining scaling on this dromedary. I mean, we're not going to... I mean, I was a... We're going to chalk that round up every time. But I'm not really going to care. So now we do this, this. Freeze this draft. Buy you. Buy you because you're a 5'8". You really don't do anything for us right now. Um... And let's just keep rolling for a second. Do one of these. We're going to get a level on the seahorse. Holy shit. He hurt his own guy. It'd be your own squad that'd be doing the most. Okay, so we're going to do something like this. Let's try it. See what happens. You. I need you. Sell you. Put you out there. Roll. Another drama. This could this will fit into the axolotl build because this gives the chili pepper to the jellyfish or whatever's behind it, which would then scale if I had an axolotl. We'll do this. Roll. So actually, I'm going to sell the beetle. I know, I know. Do one of those. Let's throw an eggplant on you for now. It's a fairly decent draft for just buying it. I mean, yes, the dromedary did put the work in, but still, I mean, that's a decent draft. And we had our seahorse two for one with their, both their hippos. Running two hippos is a wild concept. I respect it, kind of, but like, that is wild, my boy. Do this, freeze you for a second. Do this, get the level. No axolotl, which does hurt my feelings. Next thing to go is the seahorse. We did bust the melon, which was big. Level there, beautiful. There's the axolotl. I'm going to hold off around. By the dromedary, by you, and let's just throw that on you for now. So then the axolotl is going to come out as a a bonus, four four bonus on it. I mean, we're going to lose this round. That's unfortunate. That's just a good team. So we sell the dromedary. You get an axolotl. You put it at the back, but not too far back. You throw this on you. Roll one. Throw this on you. Roll one. Put that on someone else as well. 
Hmm. Alright, okay. It permanently scaled the wrong thing, to be honest. But at least some permanent scaling is good. So you, there. Let's put this on you for now. Get this. Then I'm going to think about getting rid of this giraffe. And we're going to have a level 3 jellyfish, which is good. Very good. So that works for me. I mean, that's beautiful right there. We'll do this. This. Do one of these. Let's do something like this. Screw you. Keep you. Keep both of these. Use both of these next round. Get the octopus going as well. This is going to be a loss. Close. Narrowly. So we're not quite over the hump yet. Not quite. Let's just put the octopus on there. Still at two life. Still not on lethal. Six wins, though. I think we're, we're just about to hit it. We're just about to hit the stride. Don't go breaking my stride. We're not going to hit the stride. Jesus. I don't know what's going on. Some of these teams. Some of these teams. Roll. I'm going to throw that on you. I think it is time to say goodbye to the axolotl, to be honest with you. It's not really doing as much as what I want. Do one of those. I don't know what to put out there. This, I guess. I guess. I think this run fell apart. I think what I wanted to do and what I was going to try to do um, didn't. It had okay intentions. It just didn't have the best optics at all. And uh, yeah, and I, I'm, I'm actually pretty disappointed. I'm pretty disappointed in that one. But you know, that's how the cookie crumbles sometimes. If that is going to do it for all of this Super Auto Pets video. If you enjoyed, think about hitting that like button. If you're new to the channel and want to check out the rest of my stuff, click down below and think about hitting that subscribe button. English is hard, okay? Don't blame me. Um, yeah, and if there's anything that you want to see on the channel, just let me know down in the comments or let me know realistically anything, if, as long as it's criticism that's constructive or if I'm doing something good already. That's about it. Hopefully I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.